Good morning, Bulldog Nation, and welcome to the Bulldog Morning News Show, the place for you to find out everything going on here at McCracken Middle School. I am Jess Eaton, sixth grader here at McCracken Middle School, here to let you know all the latest updates. But first, here is my co-host, Yari, to lead us in the morning pledge and moment of silence. Good morning, McCracken. I am Yari in eighth grade here at McCracken. Let's get to the start. Please stand and say the Pledge of Allegiance with me and then the pause for the moment of silence after God. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All this week is Custodian Appreciation Day, so please take time this week as you see our custodians in the hallways and around our schools and thank them for the amazing job that they do each and every day. They keep our school looking great, they clean it, which makes us all safer, and please remember that your thanks and your attention and your kindness goes such a long way, so make sure you reach out to our custodians and share that with them this week. Hey Bulldogs, we have some exciting news. During the month of October, NJHS is partnering with Palmetto Kettle Corn to send out some tasty treats. You can send a boogram to your friends, your teachers, or even yourself. Watch for boograms to be sold in the mornings. They are $2 and will be delivered sometime during the week for a fun surprise. Don't forget to get yours. We have some exciting news for the month of October. We are selling blue, blue grams in the Kiva for $2. First period teachers, please send in your lunch counts. Our volleyball team will have a game against Bluffton Middle School on Monday beginning at 5.30. Here in our McCracken gym, tickets for all games are $4 each. Please remember our district clear bag policy is social distancing for all games. Remember Bulldog Singers are meeting on Mondays in room 509 with Ms. Lyopolis, the chorus teacher, from 815 to 845. Mario Lopez is an American actor and entertainment journalist of Mexican descent. He is best known for his roles on the TV show Saved by the Bell. But he has been in numerous shows, movies, and plays. Mario also was to the talent competition show, X Factor. And now, here's the McCracken Minute. Good morning, everyone. This is Mrs. Young, sixth grade counselor. And on this morning for our McCracken Minute, we will be discussing our character words for the month of October, which are courage and tolerance. The dictionary defines courage as the quality of mind or spirit that enables a person to face difficulty, danger, pain, uncertainty, and intimidation, just to name a few. And being tolerant is the ability to allow yourself to experience adversity and not give in to its challenges, but persevering. Embracing the various feelings and emotions we tend to experience during such hard times. Martin Luther King stated, the ultimate measure of a person isn't where they stand in moments of comfort, but where they stand in times of challenge and controversy during these rough times. Courage and tolerance allows us to overcome the fear of rejection and allows us to attempt situations we've never tried before, despite how we may look to others. Courage helps us to act against those who threaten or act in a negative way, and tolerance is allowing others to say and do as they like, even if we do not agree or approve of their actions. Courage and tolerance allows us to be bold, to be brave, and practice peace and kindness. According to Maya Angelou, 
Without courage, you cannot practice any other virtue consistently. So let's take a look at a few ways that we can practice courage and tolerance. Saying you are sorry and practicing respect to self and others. Taking ownership and responsibility of your feelings and actions. Recognizing no one can make you feel a certain way without your permission. Letting go of grudges and negative feelings and forgiving others. Listening and being present just knowing when to stop talking and just, and just listen to what others may have to say. Growing and learning from others and embracing new situations. Changing your mindset and being willing to look at situations from different perspectives. And lastly, but not least, keeping your commitments to others is just very, very important. So on today and from here on out, I challenge you to demonstrate various ways in which you can show courage and tolerance in times of challenge and controversy. Have a great day.